I had a consultation of someone that is making a lot of money for the first time in their life. I'm talking close to a million in one year. And it was interesting because it's not the typical calls I get, but they were trying to figure out how to get rid of their tax liability. So we talked about that. Obviously real estate, obviously real estate, the RV rentals, a bunch of stuff I buy, a lot of people don't realize a lot of it is for tax reasons. The more money you make, the more you're focusing on how to save from taxes because it's the biggest thing that's gonna wreck you. What was also interesting was the mentality of making decent money to a lot of money. He realized not to pick on the wealthy so much and say, tax the rich more. Have you guys ever seen brackets? The wealthy do get taxed and screwed in a lot of ways. They have to figure out ways around that. But the perspective was opened a little bit to realize whether you're extremely wealthy or not, we're all playing the same game. We're all paying taxes. It's all relative. There's avenues that anyone, no matter how much you make, that you can do, like real estate. The first real estate deal, I was making 60 grand a year, maybe even a little less. And I kept buying more and more, making 100 grand, finally making 120, 150. I wasn't making millions ever. It wasn't until fast forward five, 10 years, I realized the properties I had were worth millions. But that's not the case when I first started. It wasn't to become a multi-multi-millionaire. I just knew in the back of my mind that was a smart thing to do and something you should do. Whether you make 50 grand, 100 grand, a million a year, real estate is that avenue.